Honestly, Omar Esquino um, is one of my favorite events in history. You know, I, there's a reason I, I demand on uh, coming back here every year. And I love the people, I love the vibe, the weather. Uh, yeah, it's just, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm not lying when I say it's, uh, it's one of my favorite events in history. And I hope it stays that way for, for years to come. Since 2013, uh, Vigo is, uh, is, you know, slowly uh, making its way towards the, towards the top of the list to my favorite cities in the world. So, um, yeah, it just, uh, just continues to impress me every year with, uh, with the vibes and, um, you know, just, uh, just overall the, the times I spend here are, uh, are hard to beat. And I think uh, all the riders that, uh, that I'm with here can, uh, can say the same. So uh, hard not to enjoy it. This weekend's going to be a rad one. I've had uh, some pretty heavy competition here or over the last few years, but um, I, I've managed to, to, to win a few times here. And uh, it really brings me back just being here in Vigo. It uh, brings me back to to those memories back in the day when uh, when I wasn't riding all the Crankworks events and competing for a world title. So uh, it's a lot of good memories here, so I'm going to give it all I got and uh, try to win again. I think uh, pushing your level um, is, is fairly easy motivation-wise in this sport because, you know, all the riders are pushing so hard, you know. Some of my best friends out there, uh, they're, they're pushing just as hard as I am. So, you know, it's easy to be motivated. And, um, yeah, with, with events and, and contests like this where there's such good vibes, um, you know, it's easy to get uh, to get hyped up to, to learn some some new tricks and to push your level and you know just to get better at biking so uh, so you can stay on top of the game and, and keep living uh, living this lifestyle because it's pretty cool this event vibe.